going on everyone welcome back to cs coins i'm back today got some new bags from the credit union uh, me and my buddy jake each were able to get a thousand dollars in quarters so we are going to be searching through these hopefully we can get some w's going and we are also both looking to get our first silver quarter from coin searching we've found the metal detecting in other ways but uh never in rolls or in bags like this yet so we're hoping to get on the board with that so we're gonna get going here in a minute and I will let you guys know if and when we get a first find. All right guys, we're both pretty deep into our bags and uh, we got a little assortment of finds over here. Nothing too special, just pulling aside the uh, nicer looking uh, bicentennials and some of the nicer 80s uh, quarters and all that. Right here I got a, looks like some different kind of dot chip. I don't know if I've seen this one before, but that's pretty cool. Still pretty slow on the finds. No W's yet or anything, but uh, I am going to have an Arizona extra leaf dot chip right here. So we'll hold on to that. Add that to my little keeper pile right there. All right, guys, he hasn't even looked yet, but he's got a silver. I see it. It's down there. I see it too. I heard it fall out of my hands and clink. We were Amen. not expecting that. We thought a collector had gone through these. We weren't finding anything. What is it? 1964. Nice, man. That's his first silver quarter in a, that in a coin roll hunt. Surprise. I did not expect from this bag. <laughs> That's awesome. It's real. So hopefully there's more of that to come. I'm hoping for a W or something. These are all my discards. It's just a lot of newer quarters, but nothing good. So um, we're going to keep going. Hopefully he can get more silver. Hopefully I can get one. And we'll get back with you guys if I get another find or if he does. I'm finally going to have myself a decent find here. This is actually going to be a proof. 1986S. It's hard to tell that it's a proof just because it's got so much toning on it. But that is uh, definitely a proof. 1986 San Francisco. So that's awesome. Finally getting to a better layer in these bags. So hopefully we can keep the finds coming. Now. Oh guys, I am so happy about this. I'm finally on the board with a W. I was getting a little jealous with this silver over there. I've searched so many dozens of quarter boxes and never found a silver, but at least I got something pretty good from the bag. I will take a W all day. Salt River Bay, my third one. It's awesome. Jake's back on the board with a proof. I'm going to flip it around. It's going to be an Oklahoma State quarter. 2008S. Flip it around one more time. Nice, we're both on the board with a proof. Now he needs a W, I need a silver, and we'll be all tied up. Right after he got that proof, he's gonna have an Ingodly Rust error. This one isn't super strong. The T's only slightly faded, but at, under the right light, it looks like Ingodly Rust, so it's a good find. That's his first one of those. Jake's got a spitting horse error here. You can see that spit coming from the horse's mouth. It's actually a die crack above Caesar there. So that's a cool find. Is that your first one? First one. First one of those. So he's got Ingodly Rust and a spitting horse that over with the finds. All right, guys, I got another W right here and I haven't looked yet. Just saw the obverse land here. I'm hoping this is Weir Farms. That would complete my 2020 W set. Probably won't be. That one's been super tough for me to find, but we'll take a look here. And it's another Salt River Bay. That is going to be the second one of the hunt, but we'll take that. Two W's in a bag, that's pretty great. I'm almost done with my bag. My friend Jake just finished his up. But uh, near the bottom, I've got a Delaware spitting horse error. This one's got a little bit of damage from uh, the ring of death, but I'll still probably hold on to it. It's a cool find. That's going to wrap it up for our first quarterbacks today. We didn't do too bad. Uh, I mean, my friend, he would have liked to get some W's, but you cannot complain about a silver quarter in your first quarterback. These are so rare to find. So that was really cool. He got uh, an Godly Rust error as well. Spitting horse. This proof was pretty nice. Oklahoma 2008. He's already got it flipped up. And then he came across two crossing the Delaware die chip errors. They're just going to be small. Very, very minor die chips. It's very minor die chips, small ones, but we keep on to those. Those are pretty cool to find. And then he's got some of the nicer ones he came across here 88D, Bicentennial, Denver, 73D, 72D and a 67 and for my finds down here i've got that one impaired proof still pretty cool with that toning i'm probably gonna end up flipping that up just because it's i mean that is pretty beautiful toning right there you don't see something like that too often so that was a pretty cool find 
And then I uh, came up with the two W's. They are both gonna be Salt River Bay. So we will always take that. W's are gonna be uh, pretty tough to find in circulation within a couple years. They might not even be something common to find when you're coin roll hunting. It was a struggle for me to find one. He didn't find one, unfortunately. So then uh, I got two of the Extra Leaf Arizona errors. You can see down there below the cactus, the, de the designer, get it out. Designer's initials are covered by the leaf a little bit. Both of these. And then I also got two very minor die chips. Just barely see them there. That one's on the front of the hat. And then I also got my own spitting horse. A really nice 81p and this we just pulled aside as an oddity this is uh i i don't know what happened to this coin right here but it's been through a lot so that was kind of in everybody's possession it's been in everyone's possession this thing is beat up bad i don't know if it was sandblasted or what that is in pretty horrible shape but either way um that was a pretty great hunt for our first quarter bag we're pretty happy with our finds so we will probably be trying that again in the future. We'd like to get some more dime bags. I want to get on the Mercury dimes. So we would like to thank you guys for watching. And if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. I only got about 3% of my viewers um, that are actually subscribed. About 97% aren't. So if you guys would subscribe, that would mean so much to me. I really appreciate it and I hope everyone has a great day.